guys, I'm so, so happy to be at ACME. This is my first time here. I'm really excited. And I realized that there was a real stage, and I, I just have this problem that every time it's a stage, I get super confused, because I'm like, where are the poles? Uh, I don't see any fucking poles, you guys. Like, what am I supposed to do? Like, just make you laugh? That doesn't sound right. And I'm, you know, Scandinavian, obviously, and was bred Lutheran and everything. And I did work at a strip club for a little while, and um, they wouldn't let me strip. I know. Like, where are the booze for that? I mean, they should have, but, like, I, <laughs> they wouldn't let me strip because I'm too chatty. So, like, the, the biggest tri strippers would be, like, ah, oh, in my face, you know, and, like, like, pushing their vagina on these men, and, like, it's disgusting but hot. And I would get up there and be, like, do you guys want some hot day? <laughs> hey, movies do you like? and I guess that's not sexy, so I only served drinks there. Um, so speaking of being Scandinavian um, and sort of dumb, like I don't know what certain well, I don't know what certain words mean, but I think that I do. And so like I'll hear things in pop culture, and they'll be like, oh, they they said a word named twink. I don't know if you guys know what that is, but it means young and dumb and full of cum. And um, it's a gay term, too. So you guys, you look really sick right now. I'm so sorry to tell you that, but it's that's what it means. Um, and I didn't know that. I thought it meant like a really cute Asian baby. <laughs> right. So when people would like, you know, buy a baby from China or a, a dog, a baby from China, and they would show it to me, I'd be like, And then finally one day, my dad told me what twink meant. <laughs> Don't think about that for too long, because I still can't sleep. Like, how the fuck did he know? <laughs> um, so I was married, by the way. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I'm already ruined. Um, yeah, I was married, and my husband ended up um, getting the gay, you know, where, like, they just turned gay out of fucking nowhere. Yeah, that happened to me. Um, and I had this idea in my head, like, because I didn't know what gay men actually did, that, that all they really did was smush their ball sacks together, and they would create, like, one big faggot brain, and they would use it for good. And so, like, that's why... That's why all the Republican senators turn gay. It's because they're solving health care and shit. Like, fake it, brain, activate. And then, like, socialism. So that's my time. Thank you so much. I'm Leslie Ray. I love you.